Tak off at YouTube and let us make some teriyaki chicken. start with making our teriyaki sauce I'm gonna go in with some dark soy sauce you want to put a generous amount in there and I will leave the exact measurements down in the description box some water some spring onion some fresh ginger and mix well to combine So I've got my chicken breast fillets and we're just gonna lightly season it. I'm just gonna add only two things on here, which is just a little pinch of salt, like the tiniest pinch ever. And I'm going to add some cornstarch on the top, just for a little bit of crisp. Okay, not too much. Yeah, that should do. And you just want to mix that well till it nicely coats. Now guys, don't worry that you see that I added just the tiniest pinch of salt. You need to be very mindful when making the teriyaki chicken because the soy sauce already has salt and all that stuff and you really do not want to get this dish salty, okay? So, all done. I know you'll be tempted to add more seasonings on there, but trust me, it doesn't need it okay so let's go ahead and cook this I've got my pan and I'm just going in with some oil that should be okay go in with your chicken pieces in here my heat is on high and I'm just gonna let it cook so it's no longer pink. You want to get it nice and crispy if possible. So yes guys, give it about 4-5 or five minutes till it's nicely cooked and then we're gonna flip it over. that we put on there earlier and if you don't want to use chicken breast you can use chicken thighs if you're sort of like a dark meat person now that my chicken is cooked fully this is where I'm going in with that beautiful sauce that we made earlier look at that and make sure you turn your heat down low when you add in your sauce just want to mix it up and any residue cornstarch will thicken up our sauce I'm gonna let that go I'd say for about two three minutes on a low heat so that it can coat my chicken pieces and make it beautiful look at that guys how gorgeous and it smells amazing so as you can see the sauce is starting to thicken and guys look at how gorgeous and because my pan is non-stick you find that oh my goodness look at that guys look at this gorgeous listen this looks so 
amazing. Look at the color on here. Just to give it to you up close. Look at how gorgeous. So beautiful. Guys, nice glaze, glossy, gorgeous, absolutely beautiful. So this is it and then you just want to put a few sesame seeds on the top just as a garnish oh my goodness look at that look at this my darling so there you have it my loves all done a look at my gorgeous teriyaki chicken nice and glossy so delicious I'm serving it with some of my egg fried rice which is coming up in a separate video but I do hope that you enjoyed this recipe if you try it at all, tag me on Instagram at Terrian's Kitchen. You can send me a DM or you can post in your story and I will repost. But yes, my love, it's a pleasure having you here and I will see you again in my next one. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.